I'm going to show you some tricks that's going to make your product descriptions look a lot nicer. Stick around. What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, thanks for joining. So most of you probably don't even know this, but you can make your product descriptions look so much nicer, clearer, and easier to understand. Okay, let's get started. So everybody should already know the one really good way to differentiate is to have really well written product descriptions. But does your product description look like this one? Okay, I'm going to use these grill mats as an example, but do not do grill mats as your private label product. Okay, it's the, the niche is way too saturated and it's just not a good product for you to jump into. I'm just using it as an example. All right, so does your product description look like this? Okay, one big paragraph. Look how difficult that is to read or discern what information is there. It's really illegible, right? It's one big mess of text. Nobody wants to read that. Um, here, I'll show you another example. Okay, like this one. Same deal. It's one big mess of words. I don't even want to read it. Okay, it hurts my eyes. Now, wouldn't it be nice if you could, you know, bold some stuff? or separate it into paragraphs and have some line spaces in there, right? Like a regular book or, or, um, or a newspaper or a magazine. Well, here's an example of what a nice one looks like. Okay, look, the title here is bolded and there's uh, line spaces in between the title and the dis actual description itself. And there's carriage returns at the end of sentences. Things are organized here and, and it's easy, to, easy on the eyes. It's, it's clear and legible. And it's something I could actually glance over and actually read and understand, right? So uh, the question is, well, how do I do that? So here's a sample description that I've typed out for you, all right? And you can read the text in black. It says, my product title, this is my first paragraph in my description, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, okay? Now, the text that you see in blue is HTML, HTML tags. And what that means is those are going to do things to the text, okay? So I'm a software developer by trade, so this is um, stuff that I know like the back of my hand, okay? And so HTML tags, uh, for example, to bold something, there is an opening tag and a closing tag. So anything in between the opening and closing tag will get bolded. So this one, the angle brackets with a B inside, and then the closing angle brackets with the B inside. Closing means it has this slash in it. Anything in between those will get bolded. So my product title will be bold. Alright? And then this tag is a line break tag. So anytime this is encountered, it's going to put a line break. So there will be a carriage return here and then an empty sp space here followed by this sentence and then we'll put another line break, another line break, followed by this sentence and a line break. Okay, should be pretty straightforward. Now on the bullet points, you can see here there's a bullet followed by the text, a line break, a bullet, text, line break, and you can put stuff in between it. So you can see here there's important is bolded and then we put a line break. You know, you can mix and match as you please. Well, how do you do these line, uh, how do you do these uh, bullet points? Well on a Mac, it's the uh, option 8 key. So push those together, you'll get a bullet and you can add this is my new bullet point. And then we'll add a line break there. Okay? Pretty straightforward, right? Well, how could I make this easier for you? Well, I've actually written a tool and it's available on my website. And I'll, I, I'll uh, include a link to it in the description. It's absolutely free to use. It's something I'm just giving to you guys um, to make your life easier. Okay? Now, this tool is going to add all the line breaks for you because they're kind of a pain in the butt. So, um, you can visit it here. It's called the Pretty Amazon FBA Description HTML Tool. All right. So all you got to do is come down to here, which I've pre-filled out with the same example paragraph here. Once you type in yours, you can copy and paste your current product description. You just paste it into this text box here and press the Prettify button. Okay. Once you press the Prettify button, down below over here, you're going to see all the line breaks added for you. Okay, bam. You look down here, 
all done. So if that's all you want to do, I can just highlight all of this, copy it, and uh, paste it into my product description, and it's going to look beautiful, uh, just like in the top paragraph uh, text box here, instead of in one big, in one big solid paragraph that no one, nobody, nobody wants to read. Okay. So now down here, I can add my bold or bullet points. So let's say I want to bold my title here, then I'll just add the bold here. Okay, and if I want to add another bullet point, I can, or, you know, I go like this, and then I do my option eight and add a new bullet point. This is a new bullet, okay? And I've also included a pretty neat addition bonus for you guys, and it's these emojis. Now, I'm sure you've seen people use them in your, in their product descriptions. Well, you can do it now too. Just copy and paste, like if you want to do this check mark, copy that. And you can add it up here first if you want, or you can add it down here, and you can make these, uh, you know, make this a check mark if you want. Buy me, you know, another one. This is cool. All right, pretty cool, right? Now I want to add that you can do the HTML tags in your product description to make the paragraphs and bullets and line spacings look nicer, but you can't, you cannot do that in your bullet points. So in the bullet points, what you can do is add the emojis. So you'll probably see, you've probably seen in other sellers listings, they use these check marks here or the uh, exclamation points or, or what have you um, in, their, in their bullet points at the top. So what we can do is just highlight the emoji that you wanna do, copy and paste it into your bullet points in Seller Central and click save and you'll have, and you'll see it up here in your listing. And uh, here's an example of someone that has used their emojis in the bullet points. You can see that they put them here. These are the different check marks. And we can do too, if there's an emoji that you wanna use that I don't have on my tool, just uh, log in to Seller Central on your phone, on your mobile phone, and use the emojis on your, on your keyboard and uh, save it that way and you can put them into your uh, bullets, okay? All right, and that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you found value, please consider clicking the subscribe button. And I've left links in my description for the tool. Feel free to use it. It's absolutely free. All right. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.